Honorable Assembly where the Speaker Justin Muturi has distanced himself from allegations that he influenced changes in the committee leadership occasioned by wrangles in the ruling party Jubilee. Muturi says the committee's positions are internal party matters. NTV's Enoxicolia says uh, that the details and uh, Muturi's defense of the MPs in their quest for heavier wages are also what is contained in uh, the standing orders as was debated and agreed upon by the members. Let's now join Enoch Sikolia who is in Parliament. Enoch, good afternoon. Uh, obviously, we expect that uh, Justin Muturi will not agree to this, but still, he is the Speaker of the National Assembly. What else did he say? Good afternoon, uh Mijungu indeed, as you've just said, um, it has been a busy um, early morning and afternoon uh, for the Speaker of the National Assembly here in Parliament, meeting, uh, having several meetings, but key was a meeting with the members of the Jubilee Party and uh, the Communist Party from China, or the Chinese, uh, the China uh, Communist Party, which is the ruling party in China. And, and here, some of the issues that came up were the debate um, over how discipline can be maintained in the Jubilee Party. But uh, this coming on the backdrop of uh, the recent wrangles over uh, parliamentary leadership within Jubilee here, and uh, as you remember, uh, four members of Jubilee Party were uh, removed from uh, the leadership of the parliamentary committees, that is labor, environment, and natural resources. Uh, there was the broadcast uh, committee. Um, and so Speaker Justin Muturi's name came up when uh, some of those rebel MPs mentioned that uh, he influenced the outcome of uh, um, last week's uh, process where they were removed. Uh, actually, Speaker Justin Muturi now says that is far from uh, the truth. He says that indeed, um, he says that uh, indeed uh, what happens is it's the party's choice, what happens in parliamentary committees is party's choice, what are the membership and the leadership is determined by political parties and it's not a matter that uh, the speaker has any influence uh, whatsoever. And also uh, we talked to the vice chairman of uh, the Jubilee Party, David Murade, who also maintained that uh, uh, the agreement that was at State House was about regional balancing uh, when the Jubilee Party was dishing out party uh, or, or uh, leadership positions in here in Parliament and so each and every member of the Jubilee Party was to tow uh, the party line and uh, remember um, President Uhuru Kenyatta um, and Deputy President William Ruto have held meetings with the rebel MTs, MPs to just uh, try and iron out uh, those issues but uh, most of them have remained defiant until they were removed by the Jubilee uh, members of parliament in those committees. Uh, the one that had a hit, heated debate was uh, the Labour uh, Committee where um, Alfred Ketel initially or last year had been elected as the chair of that committee. So Justin Muturi um, actually denying claims that uh, he uh, influenced the outcome of last week's process in the four committees. Ken.